Greetings, my name is Dennis Daniels. This is uh, Edubuntu Linux Spark Updates. <clears throat> I haven't logged into uh, my Edubuntu machine for a day or so, and lo and behold, I found some updates waiting for me. Let me show them to you here. First stop, of course, to get Edubuntu is to go to edubuntu.org. You'll find that updating is easy. However, I do hope that Firefox 1.5 is in this mix. Um, and the Edge Ubuntu updates. Let's go take a look at it. Escape, start D, get me out of the desktop, hit the start menu, type BNC viewer. This is going to get us into our Edge Ubuntu machine. You can see a new object has appeared in my sys tray. It's right there. New connection. 254.2 is my Edge Ubuntu machine. Go ahead and click OK. Hey, look at there. Pop right up. Uh, so, let's go to the update machine. I'm not even sure what this is. Uh, let's go ahead and show update. I'm not sure what it is, what those updates are. Again, I hope it's Firefox. Uh, here's my password. You, of course, can't see it. I had trouble remembering it there for a moment. Uh, so it loads and software updates, oh. artwork, artwork, and Ubuntu docs. Not very exciting, <clears throat> frankly. Uh, but we'll go ahead, because it's here, we'll go ahead and load them up. Click install. We'll run the Synaptic Package Manager after this, because this looks suspiciously just like a, uh, a new Ubuntu thing, a new edgy Ubuntu thing as opposed to the, the more bleeding edge. Two hours? What the heck is it downloading? Oh, there we go. One minute, 17 seconds. I'm still not sure what it is that we're downloading. The artwork, themes and artwork, splash, and the quick guide. You know, I looked at the Ubuntu documents and there weren't any uh, screencasts, so I wonder when they're going to get people, stop people from writing and actually get people producing videos. Linux is definitely shy on the video side. I'm going to pause here for a moment and come right back to you. Okay. The updates have been uh, downloaded, it took about three or four minutes, didn't want to bore you with that. Uh, so it is, updates are being applied, I'm not quite sure what those mean. It's telling us, preparing Ubuntu docs, configure at Ubuntu, etc. Uh, I'm not quite sure if it's smart enough to say, do you want to see your changes at the end, but we'll see in a moment. Uh, it's doing something. Our updates are being applied. Status bar, there it goes. And let's see, let's go check out, take a look at the terminal and see what it has to say. What did it do? Ooh, artwork, artwork. La 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 la, very good. Um, okay, doesn't look all that interesting. Okay, so I can close that and system is up to date. Woo! Alright, so I'm happy to hear that, although I'm not quite sure what application just did that. So, I'm going to go to my own system manager, my... see what update manager has to say. Is that the same animal? It looks like it. It sure is. Okay, software updates. That's um, the default. We'll click on this. Close. Uh, I can't close it because I can't see it. Close. Now let's scroll back up. And we'll do system. Let's see what Synaptic has for us. Synaptic Package Manager. Uh, it's, it's operating on different repositories than the Update Manager, I believe. So let's reload this. 
goes to check all of the repositories, repositories that I've identified. And it's downloading the files. And you can see that I've got a few more packages in here. In fact, 18 packages more than the Ubuntu people want or have um, are releasing. So, mark all updates and see if there's anything. Nothing! Darn it. Let's see if anybody's got Firefox updated yet. Firefox. This is a problem with the Debian people, uh, the Debian crowd. They're usually at the the bottom end of the bleeding edge. Um, so we go to Firefox, still nothing. It's point 1.07. 1.07, yeah, not very exciting. So uh, let's actually do a search. Zine just posted a new patch. Let's see if they've got Zine. Uh, zine. XDMX, X11, Totem Zine, Totem G Streamer. I don't know what Totem is. Let's check on it. Uh, play any Zine supported file, LIRC, full screen, Zinorama, full screen, full keyboard. Okay, now, does that mean Zine's installed? No. Doesn't look like it. Totem Zine, Totem, 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 Open Box. Maybe Totem is Debian's response. Not sure. Anyway, uh, I've shown you how the package manager or the update manager works. It's nice. Um, it's not that exciting, and unfortunately, 1.5 is not in the mix. Do, uh, do your own screencast, people, um, particularly for Linux, because there's nothing for Linux screencasting. Um, record what you're doing. Let's make uh, the world a smarter place by getting people to use smarter software. Share the wealth and publish your own screencasts. I'm here to tell you that there's not much between the developed and developing world in terms of uh, equality as far as education goes. Uh, as an educator tra having traveled the world, I'm continually surprised at how little difference there is between modern high schools in the United States and modern high schools anywhere else. There's not much difference. Uh, we can fix this. We can make the world a e more equal place, yet more equal and uh, equally smart by participating in the community by building our own LTSP networks in the business, the home, school, community center, retirement, community, wherever. LTSP.org is your first stop. I want to thank you. Again, my name is Dennis Daniels, and if this is up to you or anyone you know, uh, please send me an email. Thank you, and happy computing.